Okay, so here we have a work of art that we now want to hang on the wall. So, as I say all the time, you can hang it with one hook, that's what everybody does. <clears throat> and when you hang it from one hook, it'll hang on the wall, it won't fall. Except it's going to lean forward, it'll cant off the wall, because it must. It just simply must, gravity pulls it that way. But it also will seesaw. So what do we do to avoid that? What we do is we take the wire, we pretend that we've spaced it out one third of the way apart, so that we hang with two hooks, each placed about a third of the way through the frame. We make a mark here where the first finger was, and I measure that distance. I, write, I wrote it down on here, that's four inches. I also measured, laid out where the middle of the frame is, and I put a mark there. I then measured four inch, five inches, which is from where the first mark is, to the middle. And that means that then when I go put my hooks in the wall, I use this measurement to define how much lower on the wall I want to hang it, where the hooks will actually be, and then I use these measurements to decide how far apart the hooks will be. So from my center mark, I go five inches left, five inches right. The part that I skipped and forgot to mention is the first thing you do is you take the artwork, you move it to the wall, and you eyeball where you want it to be. So we decide that we want to put it on the wall, and we decide that we want it here. When you take it to that wall, you make a little pencil mark right eyeball middle. That's the top of the frame. When I switch over here, that's the four inches that I was discussing before. That you come down four inches, and that's where the hook goes, not the nail. All right? And then they're five inches apart. Your ceiling is your horizon line. You could use a level, but a level really, your house isn't really level. So I use the ceiling as my horizon line. I measure from my ceiling down to where I put my little pencil marks. And if they're the same, the hooks are at the same level. And that's how we move forward. Okay, so we've put the nails on the wall we did the work already, so you don't have to watch that. That was the central point that we decided that it was going to be. We came down the five in the four inches, we went right five inches, we went left five inches. Now we just take the artwork, we take the wire, we hang it, oh, there we go, on one, we bring it to the next one, and hang it on that one, and there it is, we just level it to make sure that it eyeballs level and this piece is level and it's not going to play on you in any way shape or form so this is the proper way to hang a work of art